driving through the streets showing pictures of Muslims praying with the message, wake up Canada, you are under siege. That advertising truck prompted a Toronto police hate crime investigation and outrage from the public and from officials. I've asked other levels of government to join me in condemning this very hateful message. CBC News obtained Ontario Transportation Ministry records showing the vehicle's license plate is registered to Rebel News Network, the online media outlet founded by political commentator Ezra Levant. We reached him by phone. Can I ask you if you or Rebel News has been approached by Toronto Police about this? I don't think I should answer that before checking with uh, legal. I've hired a lawyer and we're obviously going to fight. Levant posted this this video saying that ad wasn't created by Rebel News, but by an anonymous group that paid to use the truck. Still. Given the history of Rebel, um, they probably found nothing wrong with that. The spirit unicorns went crazy. Rebel News has built its reputation on firebrand commentary, recently advertising on trucks in Toronto and even Washington. And for those concerned by rising Islamophobia in Canada, This message goes too far. There are certainly many who have said that just knowing that this has been um, driving around uh, Toronto um, has been extremely traumatizing. Before Levant came forward, prominent businessman Mohamed Faki offered a reward of up to $25,000 for information leading to an arrest in what he calls a hateful campaign. Levant now calls that a bounty on his head and he's using opposition to the truck to raise money on his website. Police wouldn't confirm whether Rebel News is now a focus of their hate crime investigation. Thomas Dagg, CBC News, Toronto.